Gestures, we have a whole lot of features here. So we have air gestures, motion, palm motion, and gyroscope calibration. But if you look at air gesture, you can see we have even more controls here. Uh, so for example, quick glance. So if we toggle that on, we can actually tap this to get a preview of it. And we're going to swipe our hand over the screen. Gives us a quick view of our basic information. And I'll go back to sleep. Now we also have air jump, which basically scrolls web pages in screen size jump. So let's go ahead and demonstrate that. There we go. Sometimes you have to get it just right, not too fast, not too slow, and it jumps up and down. Now we also have Air Browse, which basically allows you to swipe left or right, it's kind of like a back or forward button. So this works with Gallery, Internet, the Internet Browser, Music Player, uh, Music on the Lock Screen, and S Memo. So we can try it just to show you this. So all I have to do is swipe left or right over the screen. And you can see as it reaches the end of wherever it is, it gives you a little indicator on the left side or right side. Now we also have Air Move, which works with the home screen, app list, and calendar. So if we try this, we can show you how this works. So basically, you tap and hold one of your uh, apps here, and you can swipe left or right to drop it around. There we go. Now we also have Air Call Accept, and to demonstrate that, what you basically do is when you're receiving a phone call and you wave your hand over the screen, it will answer the phone for you.